Us tonight, the stakes couldn't be higher. Two members of the Texas House in an election that will send one of them home. Redistricting has forced longtime state representative Mike Hamilton and newcomer James White to run against one another in the Republican primary. KFDM reporter Megan Diller joins us in the studio tonight with more. Megan. Bill, the candidates are running campaigning for the seat in District 19. Hamilton has held the job for 10 years. White is the state rep in District 12, but new lines have placed him in Hamilton's territory. It's hard to miss all of the hard-hitting political ads in the race. Now the campaigns are pointing not to TV spots, but endorsements to help persuade voters. Governor Rick Perry stopped by Catfish Cabin off Highway 69 in Lumberton this afternoon to endorse State Representative James White. More than 200 people filled the back room of the restaurant. Representative White took the podium to introduce Governor Perry. The governor says voters can trust White's values, judgment, and character. And definitely having the governor come in and give us a boost to our uh, agenda of being a strong champion of pro-life, a tried, true conservative and battling the, the establishment in a constructive way, absolutely, we're proud to get that support. Elected officials in Hardin County endorsed White's opponent, incumbent State Representative Mike Hamilton, Wednesday. Nearly a dozen commissioners and mayors from the county stood on either side of Hamilton while he addressed the public at the Hardin County Courthouse. Hamilton supporters believe he has served his district well for a decade. So pe these people vote. These people vote in our district. and. Uh, and we're very happy to have them here. When you get to this race, this race is about District 19. This isn't about who in Austin is for you and who in Austin is against you. It's about what the people are about in District 19. Tomorrow, we'll take a closer look at the race to represent District 19. Stay with KFDM as we hear arguments from both sides and dig deeper into the controversial campaign ads. Reporting live in the studio, Megan Dillard, KFDM 6 News.